Nearly 50 years, the Women's Center has been advocating for victims of domestic violence in Southern Illinois. And our Brooks Liars live in Carbondale with more on an upcoming fundraiser called The Taste of Chocolate. Now, Brooke, if it's virtual, how are people getting their chocolates? Good morning, Dave. Well, actually, all the sweet treats are going to be delivered right to their front doorstep. And one thing that's not going to be delivered, and it's something that I eat when I have a sweet tooth, is this breakfast that I have right here. This is a chia seed banana bread pudding. Mm. Ch -ch -ch chia. That's all I have stuck in my head right now. Looks uh, not as appetizing as the sweet treats. They're here for the Taste of Chocolate fundraiser. So tell me a little bit more this morning is John Pfeiffer again. So go ahead and tell me about the chocolate and all the goodies that you're going to be delivering to people. Just in case you're wondering, I'm not going to offer to trade <laughs> your banana concoction for these great things. So uh, this year, again, we have wonderful uh, vendors, uh, Cool Spoons, Cristados, Long Branch, Insomnia Cookies, Larry's House of Cakes, One Hot Cookie, Hunan's, and Ari and Sandy's Catering. And these particular treats are from uh, Neil at Larry's House of Cake, wonderful brownie. And this year, all of our sponsors will be getting a food box. Uh, don't tell anyone. In, in when I talked to them, I called it a premium food box because that sounded a lot better. So all we have food items that they'd normally have at the Civic Center and stand in line for. These are all going to be delivered to them. Uh, the day before in the morning of the event, February 5th. Well, I definitely hope you have some volunteers that are going to help you deliver all those items because that's going to be a busy morning for you. But you're also telling me that, you know, some of the, instead of doing food items, some places are actually going to be opting for coupons and things like that. Do you mind filling them in at home? Yeah, if you recall, uh, a year ago we were eating Cool Spoons here while we were talking. Well, maybe not with our mouths full, but we're, we were eating that. And obviously it's hard to deliver frozen yogurt to a couple hundred ticket buyers and 25 sponsors. So uh, Jill over at Cool Spoons putting together a coupon. Some of our other vendors will have coupons that will be good for items. And again, really just quickly, where can people go ahead and get these tickets? Yeah, so they go to our website, thewomenctr.org. Uh, click on the little cupcake logo that you'll see there. Uh, and you'll go right to the screen where you'll be able to purchase as many tickets as you like. So definitely a quick and easy way to go ahead and purchase these tickets. And we're going to be talking about where these funds are going, how you guys are going to use them to further your mission. So that's coming up. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and toss it back to the studio.